Hello, hello everybody, how are you? It seems like forever. I was off last week on vacation, yay. If you followed me, then you know I was in Disneyland, the, time, the happiest place on earth, the place where everything that you eat is delicious and calorie free, and the little characters around them. Plus, um, we timed it perfectly where the um, Christmas decorations were up and beautiful, but the crowds were down. So we pretty much had the park to ourselves for about three three days. So it was way awesome. But I want to talk to you today because why I was there was the 111111 11, 11 portal, which kind of goes in with my creating your create your best life now. The 111111 11, 11 portal, it, the, the universe opens up and opportunities are abound, and you know it's a wonderful, great time. But you've got to be willing to create your opportunities. You've got to be willing to, to create your best life. And I found, you know, when I was talking to somebody when I was um, in Disneyland, I was uh, on the phone discussing this with somebody, and they were like, but, you know, Karen, I'm, I'm 53. What am I going to do? And it's like, are you kidding me? You're 53? You have, you're, you're at the midpoint. You know, this isn't like when our parents were growing up and 20 was the midpoint. 50 is the midpoint. This is the time when most people or at least the people I know start doing their course corrections. They start looking around and saying, well, what do I want to do? And because it's the 11, 11, 11 portal, we're seeing more stuff downloading to us. You know, we're seeing, we're becoming more, much more aware. So we're kind of awakening to the fact that you're allowed to make change. You're allowed to say, you know, this isn't what I want to do. This, this marriage job, everything might've served me for the past five years, 10 years, 15 years, 20 years. And a person I talked to had been on a job for, I think she said 12 years and she loved the job, but it just wasn't serving her heart anymore. But she felt at 53, why would you change? Why would you not change? You're gonna be working for at least 20 more years, at least till you're 73. Now you're, everybody's like, well, no, I'm gonna retire when I'm 63, 64. Sure, you might retire when you're 63, 64 from your corporate job, but our generation is going is going to work well into our 80s. And I think Lois Hayes worked until she was 94, 95. It just, there's no boundaries for us. There's no self-imposed um, imprisonment for us. We can keep going as long as we want, as long as we're loving it. So please don't think, oh my gosh, you know, I can't move forward. I have to stay where I'm at or... You know, I'm going to retire at 62 and that's it. My life comes to an end. Good grief, you're going to have at least 30 or 40 more years. So don't look at it like that. Look at it from what do you want to do? The kids are gone. You know, the kids are not gone, but the kids are away at college. They got married. They're in high school. You've been at your job for a while. This is the time to look around and say, is this what I want? It, this is you, you time. This is time for you to figure out Am I happy with what I'm doing? Do I like this? And because it's the 11, 11, 11 portal, that thinking is becoming much more prominent. It's, it's becoming much more to the forefront because it, you know we're ending a year, we're going into a new year. I don't know how many of you guys do New Year's resolutions. I do them every year. I, you know, I start, um, really in the next couple of weeks I start and then New Year's, New Year's Day, I sit down and do my, you know, solidify my resolutions for the following year. But each time you do this, you realize that you're not bound by that. There's no, as you get to be 45, 50, 60 years old, you, your income is doing well, your life is doing well. You can make your own decisions. So don't hesitate. If you're ready to create your best life now, let me know, I will help guide you. I will help you walk that path to figure out what it looks like. Because I think that's the hardest thing is what does it look like? What will the next 20, 30 or 40 years look like? Because the first 20, 30, 40 years, you may not have been able to pay that close of attention because again, you're raising the kids, you're getting married, you're getting divorces, who knows what all you were doing. But you had your, you had your game face on, you had your head down and you were just just trying to get through it all. I mean, raising kids is not fun. I mean, it's fun, but you know what I mean? It takes a lot of time to get your kids to here and there and here and there, and then your husband here and there and here and there, and get you dressed ready and off to work. 
and especially to you know the professional women that have these corporate jobs it's even harder because you're expected to work longer do more you know you never get to unplug but now's your chance now's your chance to look around and take the next couple of weeks next couple of months off and say what you know what will serve me what do i want to do how do i create my best life how do i make things happen for me that's what you have to ask yourself if you need any help let me know i'd be happy to guide you if you need anything all reach out to me I'm glad to be back. I missed you all. I kept thinking I was going to do videos in Disneyland, and it just never happened. I was able to do posting, and that's all I got. So I hope this video has served you. If you'd like to um, share it with a friend, sharing is caring. If you're on my YouTube channel, please give me a subscribe if you're not a subscriber, so you'll get notified of when I go live. And the same here on Facebook. Click your notification button so you know when I go live. I try to do it about the same time every day, but I might start, you know, at the holidays, I'll probably start messing around with the times, you know, and up and going, because I'll be planning on taking a lot of time off over the holidays. So let me know if there's anything I can help you with. Remember, if you're 45, 50, 55, 60, you are in the, on the second, the, the midpoint. You're not on the downside, you're on the midpoint. You're at the course correction point. Thanks a lot, you guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.